Hi, my name is Gina, and I am here today to give you an overview of the All About Spelling program. It is an effective program that works well for any age. Beginning spellers, students who need remedial spelling help, or students who never learn spelling rules. It uses the Orton-Gillingham method, which is multi-sensory, learning through sight, sound, and touch. There are seven levels to this program, and at the end of level seven, your students should be spelling at a high school level. I can attest to its ability to help struggling spellers because I used it with my youngest son and witnessed amazing results. After using this program, I specifically noticed a remarkable improvement in my son's writing ability. And I truly believe it was due to the multi-sensory approach, learning the rules and words through different avenues and the continual review. However, I didn't begin using it until he was in the fifth grade. We tried many different programs before settling on this one. And to be honest, I was a little hesitant to use it because regardless of your child's age, you should begin in level one due to the fact that each level builds on the previous one. I soon realized that this foundation was extremely valuable to him because beginning concepts taught in level one are applied to more difficult concepts later. Even though you are starting in level one with an older child, you may make it through two or three levels in one year. Simply skim the parts your child already knows and slow down on the parts he needs to learn. If your student has worked with a phonogram-based program before, he or she may be able to begin in level two. You will just need to purchase the student packet for level one. A younger student using this program will want to wait to begin until he has a strong start in reading. And if you are using this program with All About Reading, you will want to wait to begin the spelling until your child has finished level one in the reading. Now let's talk about what is needed to start the program. You will need a teacher's guide and student packet for each level. If you are using it with multiple children, each child will need his own student packet. You will also need a basic or deluxe kit, which is a one-time purchase used with all seven levels. The only other items you will need are line notebook paper and a optional two by three foot magnetic dry erase board. Now the teacher's guide is scripted and it gives you step-by-step -step guided lessons. It will also give you complete instructions on how to set up your letter tiles and the review cards. The student packet will include the review cards and extra tiles needed for each level, a progress chart and stickers for the progress chart, a certificate of achievement, and various other items specific to each level. The phonogram cards offer a visual and verbal review of the 32 phonograms. With the sound card, students will listen and write the letter of the sound that you dictate. Key cards are a review, a review of the spelling rules, and word cards are words the student will be learning in each level. These review cards should be kept in a re spelling review box with divider cards that are found in the interactive kit. The interactive kit comes in a basic or a deluxe option. The basic interactive kit includes letter tiles, magnets for those tiles, divider cards, and instructions on downloading the Phonogram Sounds app. The deluxe interactive kit includes everything in the basic kit, along with a tote bag and a spelling review box to keep the student review cards organized. If you do not wish to purchase the deluxe kit, you will just need to purchase your own spelling review box at any office supply store or we sell the review box from the publisher separate from the kits for around $10. This box fits the review cards perfectly and comes with foam spacers so your cards stay upright and neat. Now the letter tiles in the interactive kit are used in every new concept lesson and are color coded to make learning easier. You will want to separate these tiles and apply the magnets to the back. These tiles will be used with the dry erase board. If you are using All About Reading with All About Spelling, you will not need to purchase two interactive kits. You will just need a set of divider cards. You may also wish to purchase another box though to keep your reading and spelling cards separate. Let's talk now about what is included in the lessons. Each level will have steps, which is just another word for lesson. Each step teaches a new concept, and there are about 25 steps in each level. Now the three main categories in each step are review, new teaching, and reinforcement. So this is what a typical day will look like. You'll read through the each lesson before teaching it, gather any materials needed for that day, review previously taught concepts, usually these are specific review cards, teach the new concept outlined in the teacher manual, 
This will be the time your student will be using the letter tiles and spelling words, phrases, and sentences that you dictate to reinforce their learning. And finally, file away any review cards back of the box. It is suggested to spend 20 minutes a day, five days a week on the spelling program. Now, if you're using it with a younger child, you may want to start with 10 minutes and work your way up to 20. You may not make it through a step in one day and that is perfectly okay. Simply mark your spot, do a quick review with the cards the next day and pick up where you left off. The key is to be consistent and the goal is to achieve mastery. Well, that concludes my overview of All About Spelling. I hope this has been helpful. If you still have questions, please feel free to call us at 888-841-3456, live chat with us, or email us at consultants at rainbowresource.com.